Boom 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 Come gather round Miss Martha's got a story Can't wait to hear Where it all might take us this time Everyone knows That treasure lies inside these pages We wanna be Hanging out with story Everybody wants to be there When Miss Martha reads Welcome to Miss Martha Reed's Story Time. I'm Miss Martha, and I am so excited that you are joining me for another outstanding story. Let me ask you a question, though, before we get started. Do you know what it's like to go on an adventure? Well, in today's story, we will hear all about a little tiger who went on an adventure. The title of today's story is called Junior Tiger and Dinosaurs. It will be read by my friend, Shreyan Josie. Shreyan attends Magruder Elementary School in Williamsburg, Virginia. Let's put on our good listening ears. Click, click, so that we can hear all about this adventure. Hi, my name is Shreyan Joshi, and the title of my story is Junior Tiger and Dinosaurs. One day, Junior was very tired from his last adventure. The day before, he planned a new adventure to see a dinosaur. Junior decided to not cancel his plan. Hello, hello. Junior went upstairs to help his sister clean up the room. Then he went downstairs and got ready for his adventure. When Junior saw dinosaurs, he pointed to his favorite dinosaur, the Tyrannosaurus Rex. But the Tyrannosaurus Rex was a carnivore. Carnivores are animals that eat other animals. Junior was scared. Are you going to eat me? He said. Ah, are you going to eat me? Ah. What? No, said the T-Rex. I am not going to eat you. I was afraid of you too. Do you want to be friends? I am friends with the Brachiosaurus, a herbivore. Herbivores are animals that eat plants. Awesome story. And you know, adventures can be very exciting. But you know, the best part about this adventure is that Julia Tiger found a friend. Well, friends, that's all I have for you today. But before I go, you know, I always have to remind you to. Practice, practice, practice your reading every single day to exercise your brain because I want you to be the best reader that you can be. Take care and enjoy the rest of your day and I hope that I'll see you the next time. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.